Hey YouTube, this is Phil Ebner with VideoSchoolOnline.com. I'm here with a quick tutorial on how to export your videos from Adobe Premiere Pro to YouTube. So what the best export settings and all that jazz is for how to do that. So quickly, you go um, in your project. I made this little thank you, what am I thankful for video for my uh, girlfriend for Thanksgiving. It was really nice, so if you like that idea, use it. So to export it, once you're done editing, you just go up to File, Export, Media, or you can press Command E if you're on a Mac. Uh, quickly, you can uh, change your name by clicking this Output Name, and you can rename and then set where you want to save it to. Format, Format. YouTube loves H.264. You can open all these different um, types up here, but we want to we want to use um, H.264. Um, that's what YouTube likes. Make sure export video and export audio is checked off. Down here with the frame width or the frame height, if you shot uh, 1920p, um, then you can change the frame width and frame height to 1920 by 1080. I shot uh, 1280 by 720, so both are HD. One is just a little bit larger frame size. For the frame rate, YouTube likes 30, and all these settings can be found on the YouTube um, slash Google guidelines on their website. I brought it up here. Um, you just type into the support.google.com forum what the if you want your YouTube settings, and it says compression type H.264, frame rate 30 is preferred, but like these other ones are accepted. So the data rate and all this other stuff you want to just set as automatic. For within Premiere Pro, with this bitrate encoding, uh, VBR one pass will be quicker and a little bit lower quality, and VBR two pass will be it, it will take a lot sl slower because it actually goes through the whole movie twice. But that also increases the um, quality in regards to the color qualities and just the image sharpness. Um, it it won't really increase the size of your video it'll just take longer so if you're in a rush you can do VBR one pass or VBR two pass for this target bit rate um, this is uh, where you can you know if you ratchet it up to uh, really high then it again the size of your file will be larger and the quality will be higher um, but you know you can just set it around 15 or so that's where I like to set it and then lower the target to maybe 12 so the maximum is around 15 and then um, make sure your audio is set to AC, AAC uh, the codec right here is set to AAC 44.1 kilohertz audio quality high and that's about it so from there you just go to export and I'll export and it'll be great high quality video for YouTube. So I hope you like this video and you learned a lot. Head over to videoschoolonline.com and subscribe for more tips and to get some great free resources and deals for um, my online courses and everything else that comes along with videoschoolonline.com. I hope you enjoyed watching and I will see you next time.